no, we're not gonna fight our toddler for the rush. Hello, Sim family. My name is Carrie Jessica. I am your friendly neighborhood silver-haired Simmer, the mom in the neighborhood that spends as much, if not more, screen time than the kids, and today is no exception. We're gonna hop into our star sign legacy, but real quick before we start playing, let's go ahead and check the rules again because we're getting pretty far into our Gen 1 Aria's life. So let's see what else we still need to do. Of the mandatory things for the challenge, any partner must be a good friend before you start romancing them. Done. Never cheat on a partner done you must never initiate a breakup or divorce but your partner can if it fits the story done never go down without a fight if anyone is negative towards you first you must use at least three mean or mischievous actions straight away done master any extreme sport let's take a look at where we're at we haven't mastered any um but let's see we're at level level <laughs> we're at level five of snowboarding and we're at level seven of rock climbing i don't see skiing on here i guess we don't really ski very much so we probably don't have any skiing so we're gonna shoot to master both rock climbing and snowboarding have at least two tattoos we already have those two tattoos uh, dye your hair a bright color at least twice in your young adult life we have opted to stick with the like themed color hair which is navy blue get pregnant with someone in a public woohoo we have done that I was kind of getting a little worried about that one and our firstborn is a toddler we have to adopt a puppy I am so excited for that one when this dog becomes an elder we have to adopt another puppy so that we always have two dogs in the house you should keep repeating this so your children always have two dogs in the house I just said that um, let me see reach level seven of the political career let's check that we are on level seven we're gonna shoot to I almost said master it. We're going to shoot to reach level 10 and reach at least level three of the extreme sport enthusiast aspiration. We have done that. In fact, we are almost done with this one here. And let's see the optional requirements, which I mean, let's face it. I take a challenge and grab on with both hands. So we're going to shoot to reach the, um, the, the additional requirements optional. That was the word I was looking for master all the extreme sports. Um, we're gonna go for the two, rock climbing and snowboarding. Woohoo in five different locations. I feel like all we have done is public woohoo, like left, right, and center. Um, have the adrenaline seeker lifestyle. I do believe we do, but it was in jeopardy while we were pregnant. Um, but we currently have adrenaline seeker, energetic, and people person. Make sure you have enough household funds to give your heir $30,000 when they move out. We should be able to do this because they both have great careers. We're a politician and an attorney. However, we are kind of struggling a little bit with money. We have enough to do all of the stuff. Like we actually have $2,000 right now, but I do want to do a few things to the house here in a second. So we'll see if we have any money left when I'm done. <laughs> um, okay, let's go ahead and get moving on this orange themed toddler room let's see it with all the walls up I was going to change the wallpaper to be orange but I think I'm going to leave it blue for now and we'll kind of do like a blue and orange um meshing uh, you know a blue and orange theme I think that those colors are very complementary to each other and orange is a lot I'm actually wearing kind of I mean this is technically more like peach because I've like bleached the hell out of it this was at one point an orange sweatshirt okay let's see what do we have in adorable toddler stuff let's filter this to the color orange and take a look at what we have that is tolerable to my eyes or like this orange is a little much for me i can do this i can get behind that okay um i do need to put the little like foundation for the bed the frame but i'll get that in a second oh we'll do a little toddler makeup kit that is adorable and we definitely need a potty we'll go with an orange potty we can do a cute little orange toy box. In fact, let's put that, uh, you know what, we'll put it here. Okay, there's actually quite a bit of adorable orange stuff here. Let me put these up. Okay, I love that she has like a little, almost like animal themed room. We've got the little giraffe thing. We've got little pictures of animals up all over. Super cute. Okay, let me get the bed frame that we need for her little toddler bed. We'll go with this one here. That's definitely not a toddler one. There we go. Adorable, adorable. And let's see, what else could we do in here? I don't know that I want the big dollhouse. Do I have a custom content one? I think I do. No! No, maybe I don't. 
get some blocks out. I love this. This is super adorable. Okay, I think we're good. We'll get our little xylophone thing too. We've got plenty of toys. We still have $700 left, so we're not like super broken. That should be enough to pay bills next time they come. But once we get a little money under our belt, I wanna take this space right here and make this another room. I don't know what we would need to have in that room. It can just be empty for now, but I feel like this definitely would be a room. In fact, you know, we're just gonna do it. If our bills come and we don't have the money to pay for them, you know, we'll just cry. It's fine. All right, so while it is boring and empty, we do have this other room that is done upstairs, and Holly's room is super cute. It is lots of blue and orange. We've got lots of little animal pictures and toys, and I think this is an adorable room for her, so let's go ahead and see what her needs are. Oh, her needs are amazing. Mom's are a little rough. That's okay, though. What are, what are we doing here, Mom? We're teaching her to walk, that's so cute. Okay, and Aria doesn't have work for five days. So we basically are getting a, an amazing maternity leave that um, lets me know that they're definitely not living in the United States, uh, but that'll be fun. I think dad actually does have to go to work. He does, he has work in four hours. All right, so mom, why don't you come kind of get yourself squared away here real quick so that you are out of the way when dad needs to wake up. I adore her so much. I love that she is gonna be like really into cooking and I think that it is so funny considering how much Aria hates cooking. No, oh, she won't go play in the toilet. I'm gonna cancel that. We're not gonna play in the toilet. Oh no, 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 don't eat the spaghetti anymore. Don't eat the spaghetti. Oh, so sorry. <laughs> Maybe witnessing that is what just pushed Holly into like, I need to make some good food for my family because that was really gross. And I say that since Aria is this like enthusiastic outdoor crazy lady, I think that she's going to take her little toddler out to the mountain and we'll do some adorable mother daughter time while dad goes to work today. If you are also watching Sims Boo's Let's Play with the Star Sign Legacy, they had the most adorable video last week. Um, I think it was last week, it was a couple of days ago where they did the same with their toddler. Um, it's really cute in their Let's Play because they have best friends that all have babies at the same time. So if you haven't checked that out, I'll put a link to their channel in the description box below. It's absolutely adorable. I love their channel so, so much. Oh, Holly got into the toilet when I wasn't paying attention. Babe, we're gonna have to do a little calm discipline to not splash in the toilet. Like, babe, that's really gross. It's really gross. Fight for the rush? And that's not good. No, we're not gonna fight our toddler for the rush. That is so messed up. I mean, what? I realize that she's kind of missing, you know, some of her more exciting things, but I don't think we need to fight a baby. Since Zane also has off for the holiday, we can all go as a family to the slopes. That is absolutely adorable. I didn't realize that they would have off for work. I must have said off for the week. Off. Well, they do have off for the week, off from work for New Year's. Let's make a New Year's resolution. Since we don't have work for five days, I don't think I'm gonna wish for a, or make a resolution for a promotion just because I don't know what our odds are for that. So let's say raise a skill because we will for sure raise a skill. I feel like that is a doable, realistic resolution to make. I do think that even though Arya is very busy with work and very much like has a ton of hobbies that she still wants to pursue because that was one thing when she was pregnant that she was kind of not dealing with very well was feeling like she was going to be like losing out on time to do the things that she loves. Um, but I do think that she's going to be a stellar mom. I think that she is going to be just like super encouraging um, and really wanting Holly to just pursue her dreams. Shoot for the stars. He is missing out on his dreams. I don't really see how he's missing out on his dreams, but whatever. Zane looks like he's lost some of his like muscle too from not hitting the slopes as much. I love that. Literally the dad bod that we all adore. Ooh, we have our bouquet that we bought that we didn't end up using. So oh, that looks so sweet on the table. Actually, it's not quite centered, so I don't know if we'll still be able to eat at the table. Yeah, I think we'll still be able to eat at the table. That is beautiful. I'm happy we got the bouquet even though we didn't have like a traditional wedding. I think that it is so cute. All right, so everyone is gonna take a quick nap and then we'll eat some like an early lunch and then we will go to the slopes. 
Okay, so now we'll see if they can eat at this table, which um, I really hope they can because I think the table is super cute with the flowers on it. Uh, yeah, apparently they cannot eat at the table with the flowers on it. Okay, let's see where we can move these flowers to that will still be absolutely adorable. Yeah, let's do that. We'll put the flowers right here, even though I am a little bit sad. You know what? I think we need another plant there to make it like, I don't know, look better. It needs like a different height. Bam. Okay, so now we have some cute little plants over in the corner in the ki Whoa. <laughs> okay, so now we have some cute plants over in the corner of the kitchen. I think that it's adorable. I love our little bouquet. It was so cute on the table. I'm so bummed that it can't stay there, but that's okay. It'll be fine. All right, little boo, why don't you come get some food so that your parents can get outside? Because I'm sure that they are kind of itching to get outside. Hopefully the weather is super nice. It's kind of windy and cold where we are right now. So hopefully up on the mountain, it won't be like a blizzard. Little Holly is still a very early walker, so I'm not really sure how she's going to do out on the slopes, but it'll be fun to see. Let's give Zane, oh, let's share our resolution with him and then let Zane make a little resolution. Let's see. I think that Zane is going to want to get, oh no, he already is fit. Um, I think that Zane is going to want to also raise his skill. Mom is itching for an adventure. She is just like, God, is it time to go to the slopes yet? You're taking the longest shower ever. <laughs> Oh my gosh, difficult feelings. It's hard to be near a child who inspires so much more. Oh, okay, so real quick, I wanna read this. And I'm a little confused because he made peace with having a baby, I thought, right? Like he did. Difficult feelings. It's hard to be near the child who inspires so much more panic and sadness than it does joy. It's not the child's fault. It's not necessarily the parent's fault either. Were Zane to try to explain to others, he would be met with nothing but horror and judgment. Yet how is one supposed to force themselves to not feel sadness they feel and to feel happiness they do not? And perhaps there is love for this child somewhere within Zane, perhaps, but as of now, it cannot be found and not be felt overrun by upset. What the heck? And why does Arya have no shoes? I'm so sad. I thought he made peace with the baby. I am so confused because I thought we were better than this. I'm so sad that Zane feels that way. Okay, let me find where we're going. And I, I don't think I will ever be able to land and just know where things are. I'm always so baffled as to where the heck we are. Okay, here we go. So let's come over here to the bunny slopes and let's go sledding on the bunny slope with Holly. And dad, you can go ski because I don't really want to talk to you right now. <laughs> Maybe once we like show Zane that like life goes on like we're still gonna do the things that we love like we haven't like this isn't gonna hold us back from doing adventures this is just another person to have adventures with who are we kidding it's totally gonna cramp their style <laughs> oh my gosh they're so cute can't wait to see them come down this is our first trip with holly oh my gosh that is adorable she did so good i think holly is gonna love hanging out in the snow with her mom Dad, we're not speaking about right now. <laughs> Poor Zane. I'm mad at you, Zane. What can I say? He's even got loner skis and I don't care. <laughs> All right. We are getting back in line to do a little bit more. Oh my gosh. So cute. She's holding her. So sweet. Okay. I can't wait for them to go down the slopes again. Oh, look at Holly. <laughs> Holly is booking it. This isn't even fast forward. Like this isn't sped up. But Holly is just like, mom, slow down. <laughs> All right, so Zane has to check out the Mount Komorobi info board. So we'll make sure to do that. His fun is not going up. In fact, it's going down. I don't think he is enjoying skiing. So I'm gonna have him come over and maybe let's just build a snow pal. Just build a snow pal, Zane. All right, let's come over and check and see what dad is up to. He is, he's just doing miserable, quite honestly. Um, I'm so sorry, Zane. Let's maybe have mom and Holly build a snowman over here. I think Holly saw dad build a snow pal and was like, I want to do that too. Oh, dad didn't even finish his snow pal. Holly and mom are going to make an even better snow pal than dad. It's a competition now. Look at her helping. She's so cute. Oh, she needs to go potty. I didn't bring a potty chair. That's okay. It's almost like dinner time. And I think when you've got a toddler, you can't quite stay out on the slopes as long as you might like. 
Okay, Zane, why don't you go do a little rock climbing since that's something that you like to do? Oh, I need to have him check the info board. Is that going to be over here? Yeah, let's check this info board. We'll check the conditions and then we will continuously climb. Even though he actually got hurt skiing, but I think he'll be fine. And she just <laughs> let out a big old fart right in front of it. Um, oh no, you're actually going potty in your diaper. Okay. All right. Well, we will change your diaper, I guess, when you're done. They're adorable. All right, we'll get a little diaper change going and then we will head back to the house. Oh no, you can't. She's getting in line for the ludicrous slope. Okay, um, dad, you're gonna have to come watch Holly for a second. <laughs> Mom is out here wilding, okay? Why don't you teach her how to talk while mom gets crazy? We are going to head back home. We went down the ludicrous slope one time. I totally missed it. I never even got to see her do it. Adorable. That was a really fun afternoon well into the evening of being out on the slopes. We did some adorable sledding. We built a very cute snow pal. But now it is only time to go home, get something to eat, get warm, and kind of have a little playtime, a little wind down. All right, how are Holly's needs? Holly would like a little bit of food and a little bit of bath time. Let's have mom give her a bath and dad can make some food. We'll do that since mom uh, will not be happy if she's the one that has to cook. So let's go ahead and serve. Let's see, we need to pick something that is kind of toddler friendly. Let's do, let's do some meatballs or no, let's do garlic noodles. All toddlers love garlic noodles. All right, good job, dad. Let's go ahead and call the household to the meal. And then I think that dad is ready to take this lawyer's exam and we need to file some court documents. So dad is a little bit late, but dad's got some work stuff to do. So let's come on in here and we will file these court documents and then we are going to take this lawyer's exam. Okay, Holly is super tired, so I'm gonna have Holly take a quick nap and then she can eat her dinner and then she can go to bed. It's 10 o'clock at night. We um, should have maybe gotten out to the slopes earlier. Time goes so fast. All right, let's see. What does mom need to do for work? She needs to collect some donations, but we have quite a bit before we have to go back into work. So we're pretty good as far as that goes. And all of the skills that we have to like get higher up in are all very outdoor adventure ones. So we really can't do a whole lot with that. So why don't we come up and since our man is doing a little bit of work, we can come up and do a little work as well. We'll check our progress and that's all we can do on the computer for our job that's fine and then we will let's browse some parenting forums because I do think that this whole parenting thing is something that she wants to be like she wants to do well at parenting and parenting is tough so we're gonna definitely do a little Ooh, he's he's had a few oh wait no that's just him filing court documents okay I thought he was getting excited while taking the exam and I was gonna think that that was a very good sign but he's just filing documents still Oh, he's having some good toddler things right now too. Our little bean is so adorable. Look at her. I, oh, I just adore her. Oh no, the computer broke while he was taking his exam. That is horrible. Did he finish the exam? Oh no, he finished it. Okay. All right, so apparently we didn't get to file the court documents. That's okay. Let's go, why can't I do, oh, law career and file the court documents. This candle that I have going, it smells so good. What is this? Pumpkin cupcakes. Oh, it smells so good in here. I wish I could like share that with you. Go to Bath and Body Works and smell the pumpkin cupcake candle. <laughs> and then I will have shared it with you. Okay, we're done eating and it's time to go to bed. Okay, so we also have off our New Year's Day. <laughs> Look at us. We just have the most time off ever. Um, Dad, I'm gonna have you make a breakfast. Why don't you come serve some scrambled eggs with bacon. And we're feeling super flirty. So even though I'm a little bit upset with Zane for not being more amazing with this whole like being a parent thing, let's go ahead and just like have a little, have a little time with him. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have had Zane cook a breakfast. All right, after Zane makes this apparent very dangerous meal, then we will have some breakfast and we need to, let's see, do some type of exercise and some type of cleaning. So I'll have her do a little bit of cleaning 
and then let's get some food. Holly gets up. Oh, Holly's ready to get up. She can get some food too. Oh, Zane completed his resolution. He, I almost said he aged up. He leveled up in his cooking skills. So way to go, Zane. Lifestyle spread from having a good discussion about her lifestyle. Ari had a great conversation sharing her lifestyle. Sometimes the best way to enjoy a lifestyle is to share the joy with others. That's really cute. The other thing we need to do today is exercise. And let's face it, this fam loves their fitness. So they're just going to take turns having their little like going for a run because that is good for mental health as well as physical health. That coming from someone who has every intention of sitting in the air conditioning and playing in Sims for as long as possible today. <laughs> One of the things we need to do today is bake and I don't think we have any like baking skill. So let's go ahead and make some pre-mixed brownies and sweetie you can just go play today. Okay, so mom already did a little bit of cleaning up. So Zane will be able to clean this up after he does some baking and then he will go for a jog. And we are just like living our best life. I know Zane, I know. When mom gets home, we will make some breadsticks. All right, Maggie. Zane cooking is um, a little bit of a mess. That's okay though. Zane, I'm gonna look away. Like I don't, I think if we're gonna eat your brownies, we need to maybe not see the process of making them. Oh great, Holly's gonna go play with makeup. So who knows what we'll end up with, but she already needs a bath anyway. So good timing, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh, Holly. <laughs> Holly, you really did the most, like the absolute most. Oh my gosh. Okay, mom, I think we need to come give Holly a bit of a bath. <laughs> that was so cute. Let's give her a bubble bath. All right, mom and dad have both done everything for the holiday. Like we are, we're ready to, to do this holiday. Let's go ahead and serve we want to make something nice for like a dinner party. Let's make, let's do some minced pork noodles. Oh, honey, why are you playing in the toilet when mom is standing right here? Like we already talked about this. No splashing in the toilet. Let's do a little bit of potty training while dad makes this food. And then it'll be time to invite some guests over for a little bit of a fundraising New Year's party. Zane, <laughs> what? <laughs> like, that was a lot, Zane. That was a lot. That was not necessary. Like, I am never going to their house for dinner. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, it's excellent quality though. So um, I guess we just pretend like it wasn't sneezed on. Dad's gonna do a little channel surfing until it is time to get this party going. We have reached level two of potty training. So I don't know if we can go potty by ourselves yet. I think we might have to be at level three for that, but that's okay. We're getting there. Oh, I almost forgot to get them a dog. Okay, let's, let's do this dinner party and then we have to get a dog. I have to like, I need someone to like remind me, which I realize can't happen because you're not here with me right now. That's okay. Um, we're going to do a dinner party, even though honestly, we shouldn't be doing a dinner party at our house. We don't even have like enough seating <laughs> to have a dinner party, but that's okay. All right. We're going to do a mix of people that we know well, people that we have only kind of met just because we are fundraising. So we do want to hit some different people than who we always hit. Um, let's see. We'll always invite Lydia though. Okay. And we're going to do this at our home. Dad's gonna come clean up the potty mess real quick. Why, hello, would you like to, I guess first let's let's just do a little chit chatting. This is a sim that's in our climbing club that we never really meet up with anymore. Let's talk to her about our newest adventure and we're just gonna appreciate her a little bit. And after, oh, Zane got a promotion. Way to go, Zane. Oh, I guess he passed his, his test. And let's go ahead and collect a donation. We're gonna shoot for 250. Okay, so he is promoted to a budding barrister. 
Zane has been promoted to a budding barrister. He will now make an additional $22 per hour for a grand total of $52 per hour. He received a bonus of $450, offered legal representation, interaction, and some new clothes. His next shift will be Wednesday at 9. Okay, so he has to go to work tomorrow. That's okay. Oh, I was unsuccessful. Okay, so maybe I need to do a little bit more work with that. Maybe I need to rally her to the cause first. We're going to rally, rally, rally. Let's rally everybody to the cause, and then we will try to hit them up for donations. Okay, Lydia. We're just going to go for $25. And then you, sir, will hit up for 250 <laughs> Okay, where are the rest of the people at our party? Like, they're not here. <laughs> this is a low attendance. Maybe they got New Year's party invites from other people that they decided to go to. We're going to show up our hand calluses. Like, even though we haven't been doing very much, like, we're still, we're still cool. We still got it. Oh, I think the rest of the people are coming to our party now. It was just a little bit late. I love that Holly is just like sitting with all of the grown-ups. like, what are you guys talking about? Okay, we've got people inspired to take action, but then I don't think I've gotten any donations. Okay, I'm not doing awesome getting donations this time, I gotta say. <laughs> okay, we've got $25. Oh, I guess our donation is complete. So we, we've already got all of the money that we need to get, so that's okay. All right, let's go ahead and call everyone to this absolutely delicious meal. Actually, this looks really good. I kind of want that. I mean, I don't eat meat, but like I want a version of that. Oh, who cooked more food? Zane, did you make some more food? Okay, Zane. Zane's just been out here cooking up a storm. All right, let's have Zane see what he can do. Why don't you come out here and offer some legal representation? A feed a bite? Don't you dare. I would be so mad at you. Um, let's see. Why don't you get to know her a bit? And then... I hate that these still show up. They're already married. Why would I be asking people to be part of my wedding? Like, that makes no sense. Why don't we offer our legal representation to Trevor? Trevor, you probably need some legal representation. New client obtained. Yes. Oh, how many do we have to get? It says we just started. Oh no, our toilet is broken. That is not good. Why don't we just go ahead and replace that? Oh no, we only have $566 now. I swear somehow for them both making good money, like, and having a nice house, like we have disposable income, like we get to do fun stuff. But like on the same note, if their bills like happened right now, I don't think I have enough to pay their bills. Aria has a great reputation. She should have a great reputation. She is amazing. All right, our dinner party is just about over. All right, Zane does have work in 11 hours. I am going to have him come up and do a little bit of reading, though, because he has to get to the next level of research and debate. Okay, let's read Holly to sleep because she is a tired little babe. Sweet little Holly bug. I adore her. She's so cute. And let's go ahead and have Aria do a little reading as well. We are going to read the third book about rock climbing. And then we do need to get some sleep because I know Zane has work tomorrow and Aria is still off. So she's got a good chunk of time off. All right. And while our super adventurous, adorable couple is doing a little bit of skill building reading and Holly is off to bed, I am going to go ahead and end this one here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you have not yet subscribed, you could tap on my face over here so that you could subscribe to the channel. I do upload videos anywhere from like two to four times a week, depending on what life allows. I do have four kiddos, so sometimes things are a little crazy. And I run this star sign challenge as well as the Not So Berry. I'm on the Gray Channel. I'll put those videos there. And I also do the mystical motherhood occult baby challenge we're trying to have babies with all of the sims all of the occult sims and i'll put those up there and i'll see you in a couple of days bye